it sold five million copies. But beneath the uplifting melody was a darker meaning. Everybody's dancing to this pop song without having a clue that, to some extent, it was a celebration of the atomic bomb. Enola Gay was the name of the aeroplane that dropped the atomic bomb on Hiroshima. And, you know, I was like, we're all dancing to death in, in a very bizarre way. To OMD, this song was a deeply subversive work of art. And they were determined that nothing would detract from this musical masterpiece. We're pretentious 19-year-olds and we considered ourselves to be artists, not pop stars. There was a rush of wanting to look like pop stars with lots of hair and big shoulders and... And, of course, this was just anathema to us. We were horrified. And then when people started saying, oh, yes, you're a new romantic band. We were like, no, we're not. Don't you dare call us a new romantic band. We are serious and northern and intellectual. And we don't wear frilly shirts. 